Hey guys, um, I got my doohickey box volume 10. Woohoo! Excited! So, you guys have probably already seen it. It's bumblebee themed, as you can see here on the front. And <clears throat> I'm very excited to use it. Like I said, I'm pretty sure you guys have already seen it. She's like super old, super old. I have not seen her um, accessible recently in a long time. Ooh, is that flower dye in here? <clears throat> Let's see. These are the dyes. No, it's not. And then these so there's the bumblebee there's his trail there's a set of wings a little banner I guess this is like a little tag another bumblebee and his wings and <clears throat> this is a heart with honeycombs and dripping honey and this is cool this heart and then another banner, a tree branch, another little bee trail. Bee trail, get it? <laughs> I just got it. Um, I think this is like a little butterfly, and this is like the butterfly body. And then of course the beehive and the honeycomb. And this is the early bird, and this is <clears throat> the little um, where is it? Here it is. It is the little, like, cart. And I just realized what page just I saw it right here. I just realized that is not a bee trail, that is drippy honey. It's a good thing they do a magazine of this stuff because I would not know what half of this stuff is. <clears throat> so anyway, um, I just wanted to show you that I got it. And that's kind of cool. What's cool about this beehive here is that they use this tag die to make it and I have that tag die that's really cool and I could definitely color that with my Copics okay so anyway <clears throat> I got that got another mini adding it to my giveaway and then I very very generously received another box from Gisela at Lavish Laces. And look what she did. She sent Rihanna some more mail. She will be so happy. She just left to go home, um, I don't know, 30 minutes ago. Um, but she will have mail when she gets back next Friday in her box. Um, but Gisela did not have any large flowers when she sent me my last package. So I just wanted to show you. Look at these flowers. These are kind of a little bit um, yellow with kind of red and peach colored. And then these are definitely peach back here. And then, of course, the blue or teal. I guess I would call that teal. And then pink and white and ivory. Oh my gosh, I, Gisela has so loaded me up. I am so grateful and appreciative and excited. And um, I will link Lavish Laces in the description box down below. Go check her out for your Wild Orchid Craft Flower. She's very reasonably priced. And if you're in the United States, then you don't have to worry about <coughs> shipping abroad. 
thanks so much for watching. Hey See guys. you guys next time. Welcome to my kitchen. <laughs> um, I My craft area is just too um, full of crafting right now to show you what I want to show you. So I got a couple more hauls. <clears throat> uh, for, this one's from the rubber, bu the rubber buggy. And <clears throat> this is a Tilda. I hope you can see her. She is an old uh, mermaid and not an old, like she's an old lady, but this is quite a long time ago that she came out and she's holding a seahorse. That's her arm and there's a seahorse. You can kind of see, yeah, right there. So I got her, I de-stashed this one long time ago not going to de-stash her again she's staying i'm only rebuying <clears throat> tildas that i wished i had not de-stashed and that will be staying this one also is quite a bit older um she's probably like three or four years old and she's like holding her hand up to some stars <clears throat> i got a seahorse because i'm digging the the ocean themed stuff and this is another considerably older tilda that i did not think i would ever find and i found her i found all of these at the rubber buggy so it's just the rubber buggy.com and then this also are magnolia seashells <clears throat> now i also ordered this and i thought this was a stamp it's not it's actual butterflies and I am going to put these in my giveaway. So, yeah. All right. My next order is from Simon Says Stamps. <coughs> it did come relatively quickly. I wouldn't say it was fast, but it wasn't horrible. So, I ordered the Simon Says Stamps um, storage pockets. And I guess the compared to the Avriels, but they're much cheaper. They're definitely thinner, but I think that they are um, not going to tear. They're gonna be conducive to, yeah, they're gonna be fine. And yes, I did just wrinkle that one up, but I wanted to show you guys, it's, even though it's thinner than Avriel, it's really sturdy. And <clears throat> silly me, um, I did order the inserts to go in with them. They were pretty cheap, so they're already cut and ready to go. Now, I ordered this Mama Elephant um, sentiment collection. It says, thank you, congratulations, hello, friend, and then all kinds of other um, little add-on sentiments. And for some reason, I must have put two in my cart, so I'm going to add one of these to my giveaway as well. And then I or ordered from Hero Arts, I got, and I mean, it's still from Simon Says Stamps, but it's made by Hero Arts. This love stamp with uh, the love die and XOXO, you and me, <laughs> you more, you so much, and happy Valentine's Day. And then this real cute little stitched heart at the bottom, the heart banner, the heart circle, Sending you, all you need is love. Oh, that's cute. I think it was real reasonably priced also. Um, from W Plus 9, I got this adorable little stamp set. Super, super cute. I absolutely love it. It's even got little heart banners. So how stinking cute is that? And... I got this Simon Says Stamp collection. Um, it's got a puppy and a kitty, and it says, Rough Day, you are possum. Meow, hi friend. And then there's a little string ball. And I also got the dies to go with it. The only reason I got the dies, because I didn't need these two dies, because I could fussy cut that, no problem, but I wanted the possum. I really did. So, yeah. 
got that. All right, and then um, the last thing I got was this adorable pink and mane stamp set. Super cute puppy. Love is a four-legged word. Who rescued who? Fur friends, perfect pals. Don't shop. And then a paw print, adopt. Um, you know, I'm a purebred dog breeder, so um, I'm okay with buying dogs. I, you know, yeah. So, I mean, it's okay if you want to adopt, but I, you know, I'm a reputable breeder. So, anyway, it comes with this little heart with the paw print and a paw print and a fish and a heart and this super cute little thing and a bone. So, anyway, I've got lots more stuff on the way, so never fear there will be more hauls. <laughs> Have a great day, guys.